down to 25 Days of Christmas is on. Yes! And the biggest adventure. Countdown to 25 Days of Christmas. The Flintstone Family Christmas. This is a, I think it's an early 90s cartoon about the Flintstones. Now a little bit of backstory with me. As a kid, I loved the Flintstones. I have no idea why. Okay, I watched SpongeBob. I watched Jimmy Neutron. I watched a lot of Nickelodeon stuff. I watched some Cartoon, ne Cartoon Network stuff too, like Codename Kids Next Door and all that. But for some reason, I gravitated toward the Flintstones. To this day, I have no idea why, but I still love that modern Stone Age family, even though it's still kind of, it's kind of ancient today. But I love it. I love everything about the Flintstones. It's funny to me. It I put it on as a time waster, I guess, like it, some background noise. And even then, I still kind of sit down and watch the episodes. I gravitate toward each episode of the Flintstones. And in fact, there were a couple of Christmas specials even before this one. There was, the first one was Christmas Flintstone, which was a Christmas episode where Fred was like so great as the mall Santa that Santa recruits him to be Santa through their presence all over the world. And that was pretty good. I mean, it, for a episode, Christmas episode wasn't that bad and then there was this other one called Christmas um, a Flintstone Christmas where the same thing happened but in an hour-long cheap 70s type special yeah and there was also a Flintstone Christmas Carol that I think was after this, where Fred, where the Flintstones and the Rubbles and the entire city of Bedrock was putting on a Christmas Carol play, and Fred was turning into a big huge Scrooge like Fred does. You expect Fred to be a Scrooge. And it's an hour long, and it shows them doing the play, and I don't know. I mean, I've got a lot of Christmas Carol already on this list. And I don't know. It just. The Christmas Carol part kind of takes me out of the special, really. And it's called a Flintstone Christmas Carol. I would kind of like it if it was just all about Fred being Scrooge or all. or all about, you know, the Flintstones in that time period, I guess, acting out a Christmas Carol, but not the two together. That was kind of weird. A Flintstone Family Christmas takes place after the two movies, you know? Um, the one where Pebbles and Bam Bam got married, and the one where Pebbles and Bam Bam gave birth to their twins. And I gotta admit, those movies remind me a lot about Father of the Bride. I highly think that those movies were really inspired by Father of the Bride. But, neat as it may, this special, the reason why I love this special is because it incorporates every Disney character, every Flintstone character. Okay, it incorporates every, it incorporates Fred, Barney, Wilma, Betty, Bam Bam, Pebbles, their twins, and this new kid who called Stony, who is an orphan. Fred and Wilma take them in, take him in, and Barney and Bam Bam help out, and they grow closer together. You know, it's kind of hokey. The story's not that solid because, honestly, this is Hanna Barbera in the 90s and they were already petered out in like the mid 70s so yeah the story's not that solid 
The animation is kind of questionable too sometimes. Like for instance, the um, the caretaker of Stony was when Fred was like flying in the sleigh, taking Stony away. She was like, you know, an evil smile at the end. You know, it's kind of weird. But otherwise, I love the special. It, again, it gets me hyped up on Christmas, you know? I probably watch it at least once every year. I really, at least I try. And it's the right type of Christmas cheesiness and the type of um, Christmas forgiveness, I guess. Because normally I wouldn't like this. But it's the Flintstones, and it incorporates pretty much all the main cast of characters. Even Mr. Slate's there. Okay? So, yeah. G the Great Kazoo is out, so you don't have to be concerned about him. He's not even mentioned. So that's good. Otherwise, though, I kind of recommend this. I recommend this special. If you don't like the Flintstones, and you don't like the corny type Christmas special, then I wouldn't recommend watching it. If you're looking for something more serious, then don't avoid this. Then just avoid it. But if you're looking for the right type of corniness, the cheesiness, and Flintstones, this is the special for you.